Hey everybody, my name is Jonas and I recently posted a video showing some issues I had with uh, aim offsets and a rifle. So uh, let's quickly demonstrate this. If I move my mouse around, I can see that the left hand is kind of floating off to the side. Uh, it's most apparent here and it's looking really good here. So um, that's the problem. And I came up with a partial solution to this, uh, which I will go, uh, show now. Uh, let's take a look at the weapon first. Inside the weapon I have uh, defined uh, um, a socket, which uh, is where the left hand should be. And inside my animation blueprint, uh, then I have uh, plugged in some code uh, on event blueprint update animation. Let me zoom out a little bit. I'm all the way down here. I have a little section called fabric stuff. Set variables for fabric if we are holding a weapon. So uh, on my character, I have a reference to my my um, my gun or item. And if this is a weapon, then I have a get a reference to the mesh. And inside that mesh, which I just showed, uh, uh, I look for the transform of that socket and I do that in uh, world space so when I have that I save that into a variable uh, which I will be using on the anim graph to drive the fabric node and if you don't know how to get this fabric node you can right click on the space and type fabric and you get this one um, so here I plug in the, the transform of the left hand uh, socket and also the alpha, which is gonna change from zero to one, depending on how much force I want this to apply. Um, I won't go into details about this anyway. Um, so on the fabric node, I have uh, changed a few settings here. I changed this uh, from component space to world space, and I changed this one effects a rotation source to no change, so I keep the rotation of the hand, it looks better. And uh, the solver, down here, I have the tip bone uh, set to the hand, so the left hand, this one. This is the one that I uh, want to to get, to get up to my um, my left hand socket, and I want it to affect all the way up to upper arm, so that's here. So let's take a look at how uh, it's, it's performing. So if we come into my mini level here my playground uh, and pick up a weapon uh, you can see now the left hand stays attached to the gun and it tries to because if I move too fast it will go in lag behind and that is kind of annoying I hope somebody out there can tell me what, what I'm doing wrong and it's kind of jittering uh, when I'm moving from side to side uh, so hope somebody out there can tell me what I'm missing while it's uh, jumping so much. In the meantime, I will shoot some stuff. 